Hello and welcome. Thank you very much for joining me on my very first YouTube clip. I am going to be sharing with you a bunch of lovely Ayurvedic tips, tricks and Reiki practices that you can use in your everyday life along with a bunch of other stuff that I'm not really sure of yet. I'll figure it out. But anyway, yay! So, but today I really wanted to talk to you about turmeric because it's Freaking amazing. This stuff should be in everybody's home if it's not already. Tell you why. A few things, inter taken it internally, so let's firstly tell you what it does. It heals infected sinuses, it can relieve asthma, it increases your blood count, it balances sugar levels, acts as a dewormer parasite killer if you've got any of those birdies down there in your gut, and it cleanses blood, it cleanses your skin, every function in your system it basically cleanses it also stimulates pancreatic juices it can cleanse your uterus breast milk and your semen and an interesting fact as well um, once soon after i gave birth i had a few grazes as they call them which were very painful and I, what i used to do was every time i had to go to the toilet the little ladies room i would soak my toilet paper and um, soak it in turmeric water and cleanse that area. And it was amazing because it's an antibacterial and an anti-inflammatory. So it was just two million in one, healed beautifully. Also, it can prevent cervical cancer, believe it or not, taken internally. Relieves breathlessness, which I've probably got a bit of breath now. And when mixed with neem, nimba, it can treat fungal infections like tinea and believe it or not it is known to help stop HIV AIDS and can heal cancer cells. What the fudge. So externally if you apply it I just would love to lather myself in turmeric paste and just feel the glow but when I really don't want to be yellow I probably tend not to be that extreme but when you cut yourself and it's a bleeder sprinkle a bit of turmeric on it and it will clot the blood obviously if you've got a massive gash you'd go to a hospital and get stitches because turmeric can only go so far uh, and it also it will as I mentioned it's an antibacterial anti-inflammatory and when you mix it into a creamy paste it does wonders. My husband got a cold sore the other day because he was a little bit stressed and stress lowers the immune system and voila you get these little horrible things on your lippy loos and I was like damn girl you best step away from me until you put some turmeric paste on it and he did and 24 hours later it was gone so stoked with life. I'm telling you, if you start embracing turmeric into your lives, you will just be like, yes, I have found the golden ticket. The other day, poor little darling baby, our baby, got a bee sting for the first time. And after my little erateness, I put some apple cider vinegar on it initially, and then some turmeric paste. Turmeric paste stopped it in getting inflamed, and also antibacterial wise, it just did a dream. Didn't even swell up now. Obviously, if uh, she was allergic, it would be a different situation, but she's not so stoked and there was no inflammation. So basically, turmeric again, yay, is a winner. I'm sure there's a bunch of other stuff that I've left out that Haridra, known in Sanskrit, is what, what it does, turmeric does. But please, in the comments below, I'd love to hear all your other reasons. Oh, one more. I like to brush my teeth with it. So if you follow me on Instagram, you'd know that already. And they can be kind of white when they want to be, yes. So please leave your comments below of any other awesome turmeric tips. And thank you for joining me today on my very first rather nerve-wracking YouTube tr 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 clip. Okay, have a great week.